I have reviewed a lot of Bluetooth speakers and I have to say that there are so many different models that I love. However, I've never seen anything like this. The Miro by Zbino Smart Media Center is one of the most interesting gadgets you can find. My name is Linus and here is the full review. This multimedia center ships with a remote control, some paperwork and a power cable. The Zbino speaker sports an excellent build quality as it is made almost entirely of aluminum. Also the device is pretty heavy as it weighs over 900 grams. Still it is a pretty reasonable weight considering the fact that there is a speaker on each side and the subwoofer on the back. The total power output is 20 watts which is just insane for such a compact device. Also, there are mics for hands-free calling. We have all the buttons you need on the speaker itself, but you can also control it using the remote control. It's pretty cool that it has a built-in magnet so you can attach it to the speaker. We have a 5.5 inches 720p display, which is bright and sharp enough for multimedia consumption. However, it would have been nice to see at least 1080p panel. Since the speaker runs on Android Lollipop, you can download any apps you want, just like on any phone or tablet. The built-in apps are mainly designed to watch multimedia or listen to music. The speaker has 8GB of internal storage, but you can always connect the USB flash drive and this feature works well. Also, you can use the device as a power bank to charge other devices. Also, the Zbino Multimedia Center has an RME Cortex-A7 processor with a Mali 400 MP2 GPU and I was curious how this device can handle the most demanding 3D games. Well, the performance was quite poor and I can't really recommend this speaker for gamers but it was not designed to play any games. As far as the user interface performance, it is good but there was a little bit of stutter here and there and hopefully this can be fixed with the future software updates as I have received two of them already. Anyway, we have the pre-production unit. When it comes to the sound quality, it's just insanely good. You can't really compare it with any other Bluetooth speaker out there since it offers a truly immersive 3D sound. Also, the volume output of 20 watts make the speaker ridiculously loud. The sound is crisp and clear and there is a ton of bass. My only complaint would be that there may be some distortions going on at the very highest volume settings. They created a monster. As far as connectivity, everything works fine but the Wi-Fi range could be slightly better on my Ruby unit. As for battery life, the built-in 4500 mAh unit assures that the device works for about 5 hours on a single charge, which is a pretty good result. The Zbino Portable Multimedia Center is a great yet a bit pricey gadget. For the price of about 230 bucks, you are getting a well-made device that has a large and sharp display, a fantastic sound quality with a volume output of 20 watts, a 3D sound and Android user interface that allows you to download any apps you want. If you want to be the first to get this cool multimedia center, you can check out the Indiegogo campaign page and grab this device at the discounted prices. It was Lionus, thanks for watching and if you have any questions, please drop me a comment down below. Also, please subscribe to the channel and visit gizmochina.com for all the latest and greatest Chinese tech news and reviews. See you soon.